Hello, we're going to learn to play the tune Newcastle on a tremolo harmonica. It helps to use the corner switching technique on this tune. Corner switching is where you play notes out of either the right side of your mouth and block the notes on the left with your tongue, or sometimes you're playing notes out of the left side of your mouth and blocking the notes on the right side with your tongue. We're going to go through this first with a G tremolo harmonica because that's the normal key that this tune is done in. But then we'll go through the tablature slowly with a C harmonica because a lot of people learn on a C harmonica. We're using a uh, Suzuki harmonica. The uh, Richter tuned harmonicas are missing a note that uh, makes it harder to play this tune without that note. So we're going to use the uh, Suzuki harmonicas because they have a complete scale in the first octave. <laughs> Like a lot of fiddle tunes, this one has an A-A-B-B -B format. And what that means is there's an A part that's played twice and a B part that's played twice. The, the A part is like this. Now, um, we're going to follow along with the tablature that's in the description below the video. Um, and I'm switching to a C harmonica now. So we're starting on the third blow note. Uh, the, the numbers in the tablature that don't have a, a sign in front of them are blow notes. And uh, you just count from the first, second, third, fourth. There are, there are ten blow notes on this 21-note harmonica. And if you have a 24-note harmonica, count your first blow note, the one all the way to the left, count it as zero, and your second blow note as one. And uh, then you'll be able to follow along with this tablature. So uh, here's, uh, we're starting on a third blow note on a C harmonica. We're going to the uh, fifth blow note. The sixth blow note. Fourth blow note. And then the minus four is the draw note just to the right of the fourth blow note. And then fourth blow note. Minus four. Plus four. Back down to the third blow note. Fifth blow note. Uh, the sixth blow note. Now, all these notes we've played out of the right side of our mouth. Now, for the next note, which is a, a, the fourth blow note, we're going to move our tongue to the right side of our mouth and play out of the left corner of our mouth. That's the, that's the sixth blow note. So we're going, just moving our tongue over to get that fourth blow note. 
And the reason being is because we got to jump back up to the sixth blow note again. So it's six, four, six, but we're moving the tongue to, to make the jump. I'm starting with the harmonica kind of tilted a little toward my uh, the the right side of my mouth, the right corner of my mouth, and when I'm uh, when I'm moving the tongue to the right, I'm also swiveling the harmonica to where now it's a little closer to the left corner of my mouth to get the fourth note. And then we do a the draw six, which is the the draw note just to the right of our sixth blow note. And then we finish on the uh, the blow seven. That's the first half of the A part. Now the second half of the A part starts on the, the draw note just to the right of the blow seven. And then the, the, the draw note just to the right of the blow six. And the blow six, blow five, the minus four, the, then the fourth blow note. And now we're going to play the draw note that's just to the left of the third blow note. And we're going to do this by switching corners again. We're going to move the tongue to the right side of the mouth, play the note out of the left side of the mouth. That's that negative three L with the little asterisks in the tablature. The asterisk means we're playing out of the left side of our mouth. And the, uh, the L means it's the draw note to the left of the, the blow three. And then we're going to swivel the harp back toward the right and move our tongue to the left and get the uh, sixth draw note. And we finish up with the draw six, blow six. Low five, draw four, and uh, blow four. So on the C harp, it's going to sound like this. And then you repeat that whole phrase. So that's the A part, so we go A, A. The B part of the tune starts on a draw six and then moves to a draw seven, and then a blow seven, back to the draw seven and the draw six, and then blow six, blow seven. And since you're not changing breath direction with every note in this phrase, you can play it pretty fast by just moving the harmonica side to side a little bit. And it will sound, uh, I'll play it a little slower and then a little faster. Now when you get to that blow seven, the next note is a blow five. And we're going to play the next two notes, that blow five, and then the note after it, which is a draw four. They have an asterisk by them in the tab. We're going to play those out of the left side of our mouth. But once again, we're going to move the tongue to the right, swivel the harp a little to the left, play the note out of the left corner of the mouth. And that enables us to make the jump back up. If you see that in the tab, you're going to jump back up to a draw six. And it makes that, you know, that jump from the, the five down to the seven, and you're going down to the four, still out the left side of your mouth, playing two notes in a row out the left side. Then we're jumping back up to the six. So that back and forth jump, the, the corner switching helps it out. And that's going to sound like this. There's the blow five out of the left side of the mouth. The draw four out of the left side of the mouth. And the draw six out of the right side of the mouth then. And so the whole phrase sounds like this. And then the uh, 
we're going on to the, the draw four that's in parentheses. That means it's an optional note. You can just leave a space there if, you, if it's easier for you. I like to put that note in there. Uh, but it's a draw four, blow four, draw four, blow five. Now we're going to switch corners again. Um, we're going to play the draw note that's just to the right of our third blow note. Then we're going to play the draw note that's just to the left of that. And then we're going to jump up to the uh, draw six. playing. And this we're going to change corners again. Now we're going to play it out of the right side of our mouth. Any notes that don't have an asterisk, we're playing out of the right corner of our mouth. So the whole phrase is going to sound like, the whole first part of the B is going to sound like this. And here's what the entire B part sounds like. Now, you'll notice that the second part of the uh, B part, the, sec the, the fourth line in the tab, the first ten notes are the same as uh, the first ten notes in the first half of the B part. Goes. But the B part ends a little different. It starts like this. And the difference is it's, it's low six, low five, minus four, then two blow fours. Let's go through that one time on the C harmonica without any interruptions. I also heard this tune played with a slightly different uh, ending. Either one will work, um, but you might want to learn this one also. It, instead of going... It would go... Or up to speed, it would sound like... Let's slow that down again uh, so you can get it. And I'll add it into the tabs below the, in the comments.